Good morning to all those tuning in. This is the Rebel Lemon, and today we're back to playing Mitzoza. And today we're going to be finishing the game off by doing the last half of the choices. So in the first episode, I started off with the choices that followed the potted plant. And today, we're going to be finishing off those choices with the ones that follow the bird. So let's get right into it. Alright, so... The bird eats a seed, and they can lay two different sized eggs. Let's start with the lodge. Okay. Let's go angel. I'm gonna be a little more systematic. Oh, what in the hell? Crack it open? Oh, it's like one of those, um, Russian dolls, but with the seeds. Oh, that's creepy. Alright. So, I did some thinking between the last video and this one. And it's an interesting game, I suppose. I'm not too sure what to think of it for the most part. Just because of like the level of surrealism it is. Um, but I mean, the visuals are great, and they do, like, sometimes come out of nowhere. Um, let's go this one. And then, whoever did the sound did a fantastic job. Um... And I do want to see, like, more stuff like this. Not only from the person who created this game, but even, like, just in general. Um, but overall, yeah, I, I'm, not, I'm not entirely sure, like, how to think a lot of the times on these games. Because they are really great. But, uh, I don't know. I just, in general, I just like it. I do think a lot of them are a little funny. Um, and a lot of them are really creepy. Like this one. Like, what's up with this? Uh, let's go cow. It does seem the right side is a little longer than the left. But is a little like... Like, makes less sense. Or like, less cohesive. Because on the left... A lot of it had to do with, like, flies or something like that. I'm not entirely sure. I don't remember much. Uh. Uh. Did I do this again? I think I did. And then... On the right... I'm gonna guess a lot of it is gonna have to do with... Um... Like an egg? Like the large or small egg? Well, at least the large egg has a lot to do with it. Let's go piggy. Oh, what? Um, I will say, like, the one thing I don't like is that, uh, you can't, like, skip. 
to parts where, like, to the parts where you need to continue from. Um, but in the grand scheme of things, I don't think it's a big deal. Because, like, it's all, for the most part, it's actually pretty quick getting to the endings. And it's, and it's always, like, random and fun. I scream. Um. What the f- Yeah, but I, I think I would just like to skip to, like, the decisions that I haven't made yet. In a lot of cases. Oh, this should be the elephants. Tiny elephants. I In the last game, I said these things are going to be back. And they were. And I have no clue what this means. Like, I'm also, like, curious on if this guy had, like, this crazy dream. And that's where this came from. Uh, I think I did that one, so this one? Oh, it's a little Eggman! Oh no, oh! <coughs> Choking hazard. small and then I do like how up here you can actually uh, see all the different um, things you need or don't need now let's go fire how many left do we have we actually have quite a few huh Okay. So I think I know where they are. I'm not actually sure. I'm actually just trying to speedrun it now. Not because I don't uh, like the game or anything. Um, just mostly because I want to just see... Oh, yeah, those are the ducks. Do the elephants have anything else to do? Oh, they do! They went up last time, so let's go... <sighs> That's Crown of King. How this makes sense, I don't know. Like, if this was something I ever came up with, it'd be something where I had after like a fever dream. Cause like half of this is more nonsense than it is making sense. No, don't kill the rubber ducky. Oh, a uh... Oh, that's a reference to... what? Psycho, I think? Oh, that's... Oh, that's messed up on so many levels. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I will say definitively now. I think if I were to rate this out of 10, even though I don't have a clue what is going on, I think I would give it a solid 7. Um, because I think, uh, one of the things that I'm not very keen on is, like, the small window size. Even though it's honestly not a big deal. Because I like how everything transitions. How lack of, like, coherent anything is 
And look at that, we got two more. And I think they're down the rubber ducky route. That's the only two I can actually um, see. So I think we go up. Yeah, okay. Instead of killing the rubber ducky, let's go down the boat. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Oh, that actually reminds me. Um, a bunch... I don't know where the last one is now. Um, I bought a game from Japan. And... When it arrived, it actually came with not only a thank you note, but like a little origami. And... That actually kind of like made my day more than anything else. No, that's not it. Where is this lightning? That's locked. Now I'm curious what this does. Okay, so... Maybe it's down the... Big Egg? Um, let's go Angel. Maybe it's down the Angel route. Um, let's see. Did we get... We got cracked open. Okay, so we got both of those. Okay. Oh, I am systematically gonna be doing this now. So it, it has to be down the small one, right? Okay, let's go. Okay, the rabbit doesn't do anything further than this. Because both the fire and the nail are here, if I could find them. Maybe the nail has an extra step? No, the nail and fire are here. Okay. Oh, this is gonna get annoying. Um, yeah. I think the if, uh, I think, I think being able to adjust the window size would be nice. But, for what it is, it's actually not too big of a deal. I don't think it's a problem at all, actually. Uh, I believe that's the portal. Right? Yeah, portal and ice cream are both. Huh, okay. Okay. I'm gonna actually guess it has something to do... ...with the elephants. I just wanna see lightning! Rain lightning down! So, I know it doesn't have anything to do with the rubber duck. Up and left and right. Wait, did it have? That's a teddy. Oh, I think I need to find whatever the umbrella is. And it actually might be on the left side. I actually might have missed a choice. If that's the case, I hold. Oh no, that's the bunny. Oh, I'm messing up now. I thought I did this pretty soon. So, uh, I thought I did this like bam, 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 but I guess I didn't. Up carrots. I guess the rubber ducky? Maybe there's something else here? Murder boats. I'm trying to think. 
I, I guess the only other thing would be, like, I kind of wish this was a little more, like, made sense. But I think I understand. So, that's this. Uh, that's that. That's the next option. Okay, so, this is one, two. So, one, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. Okay, no, that doesn't make sense. Because I know these are both all ones. Oh, bloody hell. Okay, let's go down the other roads. Because it has to be down this way then, right? Where would it be? No, down. Ha. Huh. Yeah, if this was a little more organized, I think that would be nice. Huh. I know it has like a full screen here, but like that's a pain in the ass when it comes to recording. Uh, let's go water. It has to be somewhere here, right? Scissors? Ah, this is gonna annoy me. Rain drops keep dropping on my head. Actually, you know what? I think I know what it is. I think I'm being an idiot. Ah, uh, big egg. Yeah, I, I think I know what it is. Um, so I think you have to go down the devil well. Go down the halo. And then, I believe... Yeah, okay, so I think it's the rain crowd. I think I'm just being a dunce and a half. Ah, uh, here we go. I knew it was on the right side, I was just being an idiot. And there you go. We have... Quite a shocking end to it all. <laughs> Matilda, they come to give us a cake. And they take the cherry. What is this for then? Huh. Oh, I see what it's telling me for. So, this is a mouse here. These are... M oh, okay, so it's telling me to click with the left-hand side will play. And then... That's double-click will do a play. That will reset. Oh, okay, let me test this out now. There's the skip function. You double-click. Gotcha. Okay. That makes so much more sense. I wish that's just me being an idiot. Alright, so I'll end it off here. Uh, not as long as the first part. Granted, I thought this part would be a little longer. Um, but I also thought it would be a little nicer to have this game be a little bit more bite-sized. Just because... It's one of those games, like, it's kind of hard to wrap your head around. So maybe I was thinking that you would watch it. And then by the time the second uh, broadcast came out, uh, you'd have your head around the first one somewhat. Ah, I don't know. That's just me. Um, I think after this, I will go with a little bit of a lighter game? Maybe. Or a dark one. Who knows. I'll see what I have planned. I still have a few games. I thought this was a fun little experience. Not too serious. It was short, fun, 
and visually and auditorily actually very interesting. Um, I do think this game deserves a lot more uh, love and attention. Um, but that's just me. I love the visual aesthetics. I love the transitions. I just thought they were all really fun. Except for the spider. I hate the spider. Fuck that shit. I hate spiders. Just, no. Burn it, everything to the ground if it has a spider in it. Hate them. Hate them, hate them, hate them. But, otherwise, great game. And I'm hoping you like the games I have set up for our next broadcasts. But until then, thank you for tuning in on our frequency. This is the Rebel Lemon signing off. So good night and sweet nightmares.